Coming to you from Studios 1162, Vantage Point starts right now. Hey Eagle Nation and welcome to Vantage Point. Where we see you. I'm Ariella Cornell. And I'm Lars Old. Thank you for joining us. Here's the latest news. Cleveland's Teen Health Clinic has teamed up with a counseling team to offer a space for parents to connect and get support during this holiday season. Families can learn some tips for stress management and learn how to access additional support resources. This virtual event will take place on Tuesday, December 8th at 6 p.m. More information can be found on the school's website. Cleveland has a way for you to reserve library books online. Simply go to the link below and enter your SPS username and password. Once you find the book you want to check out, you can put it on hold. The book will be ready for curbside pickup on the next distribution day. Speaking of distribution day, the next one will be held on Wednesday, December 9th from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. in the main parking lot. Students should check with their teachers to see if they need to pick up any supplies. Face masks are required and students are asked to please practice social distancing. Navigating the financial aid process can be difficult. For that reason, Cleveland is offering a virtual event for Spanish speaking families to learn about the college application and financial aid process. The event is open to Spanish speakers across all grade levels and takes place on Thursday, December 10th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. Sign up on the school website. Families in attendance will be entered into a raffle for gift cards. Today is the last day to purchase spirit gear. All orders must be in by midnight. Items include tees and crewnecks. Go to school pay and order your spirit gear before time runs out. As the coronavirus forced everyone inside, Cleveland students and teachers turned to video games to connect with one another. Listen as these eagles explain how the video game Among Us is getting them through the pandemic. As the pandemic hit, a new online game Among Us has seen large interest by both students and teachers alike. The gameplay is simple. Upon start, players are randomly designated as either crewmate or an imposter, and then set loose in a spaceship to either complete tasks as a crewmate or attempt to eliminate all of the crewmates as the imposter. The game is similar to the popular game Mafia. Junior Kong Tang uses the game to hang out in a virtual setting with friends. Um, since we are playing the game, uh, we interact with each other more. If we weren't playing, I feel like I'd talk to them less. Mr. Donahoe, an AP biology teacher, not only uses the game as a reward to students, but also as a means of connecting better with them. So my advisory students are 10th graders, so I had them all year last year. I got to actually meet them in person, whereas my AP bio students, I have fully only known them online. Um, so it definitely helped a lot to kind of see different people's personalities, figure out like, you know, because everybody plays the, the game a little bit differently. Some people just try to be like goofy. Um, other people try to be like super sneaky. Other people try to be like the detective and they're all about like logic and getting all the facts. Um, and I think that like, depending on how you play the game, it also kind of shows those parts of your personality. And so that was a good way for me to see those parts of my students' personalities. 2021 yearbooks are on sale for $50. Don't wait to buy it. The price will increase in February. Payment plans are available. Seniors have the option to purchase a bundle package, which includes a personalized yearbook, a senior salute, a class of 2021 baseball tee, and a set of color pencils to match the theme of the book. Prices vary based on the size of the salute. More information can be found on the school website. There is still time to submit a photo for the yearbook. The deadline has been extended to Wednesday, December 9th. The sophomore class is ahead with more than 150 photos submitted. 10th and 11th graders have the option to use their photos from last year, but you are still required to fill out the form. Submit your photos at tinyurl.com slash CHS Picture Day 2021. Attention sophomores, the University of Washington is excited to announce new school year enrichment courses for high school students. Apply for the UW STEM sub to take classes like coding, programming, and writing. The registration deadline is December 28th and courses begin January 5th, 2021. 
For more details and information on how to register, check out the weekly bulletin on our school website. The PTSA is hosting a virtual holiday social event for all Cleveland parents on Monday, December 14th at 6.30 p.m. Parents will have a chance to mingle and have discussions with PTSA board members. A link to the meeting can be found on the group's Facebook page and our school website. We are counting down the days until winter break. There are only two weeks left. That's only eight classes. There will be a one hour early release on Friday, December 18th. School will resume on January 4th, 2021. Well, that's it for this episode. It's been a pleasure for us to see you from this vantage point. Until next time, I'm Lars Olt. And I'm Mariella Cornell. Stay fly, Eagles, and keep soaring on.